All right, uh, headline from CNBC. Chipotle Target used TikTok to find the workers they need in a tight job market. So this is really interesting. Uh, I'm assuming most people now know what TikTok is. Even Joe knows what TikTok is. Uh, so, you know, Joe is your, your Joe's your, your, your late, your late adopter on TikTok. Wait, you look at me like you're insulted, Joe. I know TikTok. Joe, Joe you're, 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 you're 50, what do you know? Eight. 58. I mean, not every 58-year-old in the United States knows what TikTok is, do they? Is it that big of a deal? Uh, yeah, okay. You think it is? Okay. Yes, I do. All right. I'm recently on the talk, as I like to call it. It makes my kids roll their eyes. I have a, a 15, a 13, and a 12. And so we recently opened up a, an account on TikTok because this article. Um, people are putting career advice out there, and it's it's kind of pathetic. So the team was like, we need to get your stuff out there. I'm like, me, TikTok? I'm not going to dance. I can't dance. I won't dance. And they're like, no, 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 no. It, it's good content. You can do it. So anyway, we got on TikTok. And... I think we were, what, four posts in? And one of my TikToks went nuts. 580,000 views. And so, of course, I have no clue about this because I don't pay attention to TikTok. And one of my kids notices on a Sunday afternoon. He's like, Dad, you're getting all these notifications on your phone from TikTok. Can I look at it? I go, sure. What is it? He's like, whoa, dad, you got like 12,000 likes. And I'm like, oh, okay. Uh, apparently, he's like, 500,000 views. He goes, and the video's not any good. That's what he said to me. So in case anybody's worried about me getting a big head, uh, don't be alarmed. So now, if you want to follow me on TikTok, you can, Joe. Will do. Ken Coleman Show is the handle. I'm huge on the talk. As I like to say. By the way, I'm so glad. There's some folks out watching, and they're laughing. They're probably my age. My kids, when I say that, I walk in the house that night, and I go, hey, guys, Dad is huge on the talk. Their eyes rolled so hard, I thought they were never going to come back. I thought we were going to have to take them to the eye doctor. All right. In case anybody wonders if I have ADHD, the answer is yes. Uh, Chipotle, Target, WWE, and Shopify are among some of the big brands that are teaming up with TikTok resumes. This is a pilot program that lets job candidates submit video resumes on TikTok. Now, while I don't know anything about TikTok, I said on this program a year ago, watch what happens. We are going to see video resumes become a thing. I was in a meeting with our team and I said, I'm telling you, we better get on this. It's going to happen. Videos everywhere now. Uh, with stories, and then here comes TikTok and video all over the place. It's like, why wouldn't you do a 30 to 60 second first impression video? And I mean, if you're 55, you ought to be thinking about this. I'm telling you, this is now a thing. Because whether or not this pilot program goes anywhere or not, I've got a video coming out on TikTok, I think next week, where I'm coaching them on my resume template. Look, look, Employers are going to look at you, and if you in 30 or 60 seconds can, number one, look impressive, number two, come across as a desirable candidate because of your enjoyment of the work and maybe even a, a, a direct description of the type of work you want to do, companies are going to, they're going to come after you. And what is a resume anyway? Here's what we know. Listen to this. Hiring managers spend on average, you ready for this? It'll blow your mind. 7.4 seconds scanning your resume. Look at this. One, 1,000, two, 1,000, three, 1,000. You get my point? But if you give them a 30 to 60 second video with the same headlines that we put in the Ken Coleman Show resume template, they are going to be blown away. By the way, that resume template's free at KenColeman.com. All right. So this is a new pilot program. Submitting video resumes and it's going to take off. All right. So why are they doing this? Well, you'll notice that these are hourly wage jobs, Chipotle, Target. I don't know what WWE and Shopify are hiring for, but a lot of restaurants can't get workers. So they're out scouring for where the young people are. They're on TikTok with 46-year-old, soon-to-be 47-year-old Ken Coleman. Did I mention I'm huge on the talk? I said that once already? Okay, good. So McDonald's. Listen to this. McDonald's is now not only increasing hourly pay, 
but they're giving workers paid time off and covering tuition costs. Okay. I also said this on the program. If you want to get hourly workers back in, you better give them more than hourly pay. At the end of the day, they still look at your hourly wage job as kind of a crappy job. So money with unemployment benefits still out there is not going to be enough, leaders. I told you this. Good on McDonald's. Paid time off and help with tuition. They're giving these young people a ladder. They're giving the 25, 26-year-old who's down on their luck, kind of had a rough situation and trying to get back on their feet. They're giving them a ladder. Increased pay, paid time off, tuition. Are you kidding me? Now McDonald's is an opportunity, not just a job slipping and sliding in the back. Anybody that's ever worked at a fast food restaurant got that reference. If I tried to work in a fast food restaurant, I'd blow my ACL out in the first two days. I remember as a kid, I worked back at McDonald's for a third job one summer, the slipping and sliding with the amount of grease. By the way, public service announcement, if you're somebody who's eating too much fast food and you're trying to break the habit, um, go shadow somebody in a uh, fast food restaurant. It will take care of it. <laughs> I, I know, I'm going to get a nasty email from somebody at McDonald's, but unless they've improved conditions mightily, it is a grease fest back there. And if you feel good about eating that food after working in those kitchens, well, I can't help you.